we pride ourselves on being a high-tech company, but we've hit a major snafu around the issue of social networking in the workplace, especially among millennials. So how do we even begin to contain that? Managers are very worried about the encroachment of social networking at work and worried about how to manage it. I advise stick to the three Ps. Focus on policy. Does everyone know what the policies are, especially the managers, so we can explain it to everybody else. Practice. You know, help people tweak what's appropriate and what's not so they really know what they can and can't do. And finally, the personal. You might need to do some personal coaching with people on what's appropriate, like etiquette. Is it okay to have MySpace up on your screen when the big boss walks by? That's probably not the best career move. Your millennials are going to need some coaching. How can you go about drawing some reasonable lines around social networking at work? What we suggest is treat social networking like you would treat any other kind of personal time at work. It's really just the way millennials like to take a break. They call it the virtual water cooler, mm -hmm. right? It's a way to log in with friends and, and have a little break time from work. Police it that way. If people are abusing it, you can call them on it. But mostly the idea is to just pay attention to whether or not people are being productive. If they're getting the work done, you're probably doing fine. And is there a way to turn this social networking use to the company's advantage? I think that's, that's one place where millennials can really help all of us to shine. And we're seeing companies now turn social networking into business networking. Can we use the social networks to tout our latest products or do PR for the company or really get our name out there? And that's, that's where millennials can help all of us be more creative and put these great tools to work. And how do you go about monitoring all of the social networking use? I'd say really treat it like you would any other workplace policy. If it's, if it's something you wouldn't do at work, you know, in one of the other areas, then don't do it on social networking. Don't visit sites that are inappropriate. Don't engage in conversations that are inappropriate for the workplace. A lot of that's just common sense. In summary? In summary, social networking can feel big and scary, but stick to the three Ps. Know the policies help your employees get their arms around best practices, and then do personal coaching when it's needed so people really know what the rules are and they don't do something wrong that might get in the way of their careers.